Hi guys, uh, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I am filming a closet tour. Um, this has been requested quite a few times. Uh, so I thought I would show you uh, some of my clothes, not all my clothes, because I do have quite a lot. Um, I don't really buy that many clothes. Like, I just started saving a lot of money and yeah, I don't need any more clothes so why would I spend more money? So my shoes are in a separate closet, kind of, a uh, cabinet thing. So if you would like to see a shoe collection video or anything then I would love to film that. Um, but for today we are just showing my closet and some of my favorite pieces that are in my closet. So yeah, I hope you enjoy. Okay, so I got this closet at IKEA and it has two doors, two sliding doors. One is a full length mirror and one is just a normal door. So behind this door I have four shelves. So I kind of organized every one of them. Um, at the top I have hoodies and jumpers. Um, these are the hoodies that I don't really wear that much. Um, on the other side of the closet I have the clothes that I wear the most. So. I will show you that later but these ones are just some concert hoodies and like merch and stuff that I just don't wear on a regular basis but sometimes at night or when I'm sleeping or anything like that. Then on the second shelf I've got t-shirts that I do wear but also not the most because they are in that side. Um, some long sleeves that I don't wear that much and some t-shirts that I really don't wear. At the back I have some t-shirts that I do not wear but I also can't throw them away because they are just too special and like bought at Disney or concerts but they are just too small now so I won't wear them anymore. So on this shelf I have some jeans. I only have three or four pairs of jeans that I wear so I really need some new ones but I'm still waiting until I have enough money to buy some Levi's jeans because I heard that they are really great so yeah I want to wait before I spend that much money on a pair of jeans um, then I have some leggings here and all my belts that aren't organized but oh well they're there then on this one I have my socks and some cami tops and my underwear and bras so yeah, I just bought these little baskets from IKEA as well to sort them. And yeah, it's really handy. So you have everything in one place. And all the way at the bottom, I have some workout clothes and shorts and skirts that I don't wear now because it's winter, obviously. And some hats at the back that I don't wear either. Like I said, on this side, there's a mirror on the door so I can see my outfits as well. Um, on this side, I have the clothes that I wear the most and are the most expensive so like branded clothes or I have a lot of clothes from Brandy Melville and I just like to hang them because they are really nice clothes and yeah I just wear them a lot so at the top I have my long sleeves hoodies and sweaters um, so some of my favorites are this hoodie from Benny Melville. I think you all know it. It's like the signature butterfly patch at the front of the hoodie and they have this in white as well, I think. So yeah, this is one of my faves. Then also one of my faves is this hoodie. And this hoodie is from Levi's. Um, I think it's uh, one of the newer collections and they tried to recreate or they recreated the old logo of Levi's I think. I think that's what I read somewhere. Um, but I really liked the colors on this and I wanted a white hoodie that I could wear. So because I only had a lot of dark and black hoodies so I just wanted a white one and I thought this one was really cute so I bought it. Then my third favorite item is a long sleeve top. This is from Brandy Melville. It's this one um, that a lot of people probably know as well. They also have this on a t-shirt. Uh, but this one has long sleeves attached to it with stripes. And I just thought it was kind of different because I don't really wear a lot of stripes. And I just thought this was really convenient because you don't have to 
buy a separate long sleeve to wear under it so this one already has the long sleeves on it so I just thought it was really nice it's kind of oversized but I normally tuck in my t-shirts anyways like I have today uh, this shirt is from Brandy Melville as well by the way so really love this one as well wear that a lot so yeah I also have some jackets hanging here I only have two denim jackets because I don't really wear them in winter anyways because they are still a bit too cold but in spring and summer I am wearing denim jackets and this is one of my favorites um, this is a vintage den denim jacket and I got this at my internship last year in Amsterdam um, so you can't buy this anywhere because it is vintage and one of a kind I think um, I really like that it has pockets on the back and the colors are really nice and yeah i just thought it was really cool that this was a vintage jacket and that it is one of a kind that no one else has so it's kind of special and yeah it just fits really ni nicely it's a bit oversized but with denim jackets i think it's really cute to wear them oversized anyway so yeah okay so let's move on to the bottom of this side of the closet so at the bottom of this side of the closet, I have my t-shirts that I wear most of the times. Um, don't mind my bedding down here because I had to put it somewhere. So just put it in the closet and no one will see. But then I filmed this video and you all now know that it's there. But it's fine. It's not in the way, so that's all good. Um, so yeah, I also have quite a few favorite t-shirts. Just not really wearing them right now because it is January and it is too cold to wear a t-shirt alone. So I would sometimes put a t-shirt underneath a hoodie or underneath a sweater just to have layers. So I can always take off the hoodie and have a cute t-shirt on or anything like that. I wear them in summer most of the times. So some of my favorites are, well, this one. This is from Adidas and... Kylie Jenner, the collection that they made together. Um, this was on sale at the Adidas store in my town and yeah it was normally quite expensive but I think I got it for like 15 euros so I was like okay I'm getting that. Uh, it's a really unique color I think. I don't have anything in this color and it's kind of like a bluish purple one with the Adidas logo down the side and at the front and yeah it's kind of like a crop top but yeah, I do like that because I am wearing high-waisted jeans anyway, so yeah. And I know you probably noticed that I have quite a lot of like empty hangers in my closet, but that's because some of my clothes are in the in the wash, so I can't show them. But I don't think there are any of my favorites in there right now, so yeah. There are some empty racks in here, some empty hangers in here, but that's fine, okay. We're moving on. Uh, another one of my favorites is this one. Um, this is from Benny Melville and I have worn this quite a lot in summer. It is really cute. It is blue with white stripes and has three little flowers at the front. And yeah, it's also kind of cropped because in Brandy Melville everything is cropped or just really oversized. There's not really anything that's just a normal fit, but oh well, one size fits all. Don't support that, but okay. And I also have this shirt from Benny Melville. This was the first one that I ever bought there. Um, I was in London with a friend on holiday uh, and I've never been to a Benny Melville store, I don't think. Maybe I went to the one in Amsterdam before, but I didn't buy anything because it was just too expensive for me. Um, but in London I thought, okay, well, I'm here anyway and I really wanted something from Benny Melville. So this was the only thing that I got as well. Um, I think it was like 18 euros or 20 euros or something. Uh, but yeah, I really love this one. Um, it's a forget-me-not flower. And yeah, not oversized, but also not really cropped. It's like kind of a weird length, but also the sleeves are kind of weird. But oh well, I still love it and I wore this a lot in summer as well. Then also from Brandy Melville is this t-shirt um, but yeah this is really oversized like not that oversized that you can wear it as a dress or anything but 
like pretty oversized don't really care about what's on it yeah i love the colors like green purple and blue together so i saw this on the brandy melville instagram page and i thought it was really cute so i bought that as well i also i think i have an instagram post in this with my neon pink biker shorts on and because there is neon pink in here as well it was quite a yeah it was a cute look so you can pair it with biker shorts or mom jeans or skinny jeans it really doesn't matter whatever and then the last shirt that i really like is this champion shirt um it's the normal basic white one with the logo at the front or like the writing um yeah i bought this at urban outfitters uh, also on sale i think um it was like 20 euros or something i just thought it was a really good deal for a champion shirt um i used to have a champion sweater as well but something happened during washing time and it shrunk so i didn't fit in it anymore and it was just way too tight to wear so yeah i really want a new one but they are so expensive that i just wait until they are on sale somewhere so that's how i work <laughs> with buying clothes just wait for them to come on sale and buy them in bulk like different colors same sweater i don't care if they are on sale i'm buying them so so that was my closet that's me hi thank you so much for watching this video uh, i hope you enjoy it and i know it wasn't a long video but i do have quite a lot of clothes but not really that interesting but it was requested so i thought i would film it and i still hope you really liked it and please give it a thumbs up and comment down below some more video ideas like i asked you in the last video and thank you so much for the people that did comment um i really love that there are people taking the time to comment on my videos and also subscribe if you haven't already and yeah i will see you in my next video bye